Hi friends, so in the previous two tutorials what I did was I created two simple scripts that would read in the directories and the file names in a specified location. So in this uh, tutorial what I will do is that I will create a simple script that will identify all the txt files and it will also print their contents uh, on the screen. So let's get started. Uh, so what we need to do first is that we need to import the OS module Just import that After that, let's create a uh, for loop like in the previous ones and create a uh, few variables and we are saying uh, So let me type this command and then I will explain it Just in case you haven't watched those previous tutorials So I've explained them in the previous tutorials as well But I will go over them quickly in here, in here as well, so so in here what I'm doing is that I'm creating a for loop and I'm declaring three of these variables path, dirs, and files and I'm using the walk function of the OS module which I have imported in here and then I'm passing in here the file location from which I want to read the files now once I do that I create another for loop and this time I am saying that for f in files so this is the files that in here i have identified so what i'm saying is that um, read all of those files and individually store them in the f variable each one of them so every time it goes through this for loop it will identify each one of them as f so the first file it finds it's f the second file it's f third so that's how um, it works now the next thing that we need to do is uh, if create another variable called file name now we are saying that os.path.join and now i'm joining there's not there sorry path with f so what it does is that um, in here i'm declaring a variable file name it is joining it's joining what the path this one which identifies the, the directories in which those files are found and this uh, f which identifies those individual files now if you don't know uh, what how this is or how it works and what is the difference you can watch my uh, previous two tutorials i have explained them in depth now in this one what i will do is that i will open it now i'm saying that with open file name and then i'm saying uh, passing in the r option to read it as my file and what i'll do at the end is that print my file dot read now so what it does with open what it does mean means is that open this file called file name so this holds the name of those files and then this i'm here passing is the I'm passing in the r argument to read it as my file and in here i'm printing that my file that file that's my file the variable so let's run this so this is it uh, so let me open this in here as well so this is documents directory dir tree so these are the three files that i have uh, their contents are shown in here so the first one this this is line one this is line two this is line three four this is the contents of the second file this is the contents of the third file so this is how you can uh, read in all the files in a particular directory using python using just a simple script and uh, you can add further functionality into it so if you can read it let's say you have like 10 20 logs they are very large in your in a particular directory and what you want to do is only find the lines that has things like uh, let's say error or security alert and these things so this is how you can uh, read those files how to search for those terms that i will cover in the next tutorials because i don't want these tutorials to get very long and boring so in the next tutorial i will uh, add more functionality to this file so what it will do is that uh, it will add it will search these files for a particular string like let's say alert or security alert or password or anything and it will only identify those lines and print it so this is it for this tutorial if you have any questions or suggestions feel free to put it in the comment section below and i'll see you guys in the next one